Hi guys, my name is Ashish and today I'm going to show you how you can create a date hierarchy column. Okay, so let me download a sample data set from here. Load sample data set. I will just load it. Okay, so now we have a financial table uh, and it is having a date column here. So let me show you how we can create a date hierarchy. So first of all, you will need some columns uh, like if you want hierarchy of year, quarter and month. So you will need those columns in your data model. So here I can see I have year, but I don't have any month or quarter. So I will first have to create the, uh, the columns. So let me create a column for quarter and month. So I can also see here I have month name. So I will just need a quarter column. So I will create a new column called quarter. So this is the date column. Here we will extract quarters, which is slash MQQ. So this will give me quarter names. So now uh, I will create a date hierarchy. So you will go to the uh, highest hierarchy and uh, right click create hierarchy. So you can see uh, a hierarchy is created where we have a year column here. You can also change this name as a date hierarchy. Now, what I will do is I will add these quarter columns and month columns into this hierarchy. So right click on quarter and uh, you will get a get an option add to hierarchy you can add to the date hierarchy. Similarly, you will do for month name. Right click add to hierarchy add to date hierarchy. So as you can see, we have a hierarchy now of year, quarter and month. So I will show you in a graph so I right, take a column chart and I uh, pull this date hierarchy in this column chart and pull profit from here so if you go one level down you can see it's uh, showing year and quarters if you go one more level down you can see it has it is showing a year and then quarter and then months so this is the way you can create hierarchies that's it. Thank you.